This is Pranav Guha Thakurtar from Edu TV. Today we are with the famous principals. We have with us Miss Karuna Varma. She's the principal of Sam International School Dwarka. Madam Manju Sharma. She's the principal of Delhi Public School South Bangalore. And we have Madam Rashna Pan. She's the principal of Ramjas School RK Pura, New Delhi. Karuna, ma'am. Yeah. Uh, what is your advice to students, parents, and teachers? During these medical emergency time, and a lot of new developments are there. Like we interviewed some principals a week back, the things were different. Now things are different. Uh, the online classes also very nicely started from probably all the schools. So, what is your advice? How do you look in the future? Yes, ma'am. Prana, very good morning, and good morning to all other colleagues also. Uh, the first thing which I want to say, Pranav, that uh, since it is lockdown situation and uh, they should take care of themselves not only parents not only my children even the teachers even the other citizens they must follow the instructions and they must stay at home stay safe because more they go out obviously more it will spread so uh, i think this is the first thing yeah we we know that um, mm -hmm. we are at home and um, teachers fraternity basically talking about which we you know we, we never thought that teachers would be teaching from home but yes something very good has happened that teachers have started teaching through online and everyone is trained now uh, to take online classes so when the lockdown opens, it can be used as a powerful tool to, you know, conduct remediations, to conduct certain assessments. So this is something what we have gained from this situation. I know, you know, I mean, we cannot make up with the, those six hours classes because sitting online in front of the uh, screen for more than three hours, it's not possible. But still, as we always say that we should not look at the glass, half filled glass, we should, uh, uh, or, or empty glass, we should look at the filled glass. So we should look for the positives and uh, do as much as best we can as the teaching fraternity. Manju ma'am, what yes, is your friend. suggestion in this uh, lockdown, lockdown period for students, teachers, schools, school heads, parents, uh, the first thing I would like to say is that, you know, the uh, parents should not get anxious about uh, their children being at home and uh, children also should not get too stressed out, especially the children of the board classes. We are getting mails from parents asking us about how we are going to complete the syllabus, etc., etc., whose children are studying in grade 10 and 12. So even though the online classes are going on in full swing, Teachers are uploading assignments. The students are even submitting assignments and project work, etc., which is being evaluated then on. But still, I would think that out of every adversity, there arises an opportunity. Right. And uh, this is a golden opportunity for us to explore how well we can, uh, you know, uh, make use of the situation and uh, try and teach with other methods. So we've been encouraging teachers to use uh, online platforms and to do a lot of research work. Um, and um, yeah, I would uh, certainly, even the school counselors have been uh, taken aboard and uh, they have been getting a few calls from students expressing their anxiety. So the counselors are also doing a good job. They've prepared uh, PPTs and slides which we are uploading on our uh, online portal system for parents as well as students. Uh, Rashna ma'am, I think yeah. you have dealt with all kind of parents, all kind of students. What is your advice to everyone on this lockdown? The first thing that we should do Pranav is that to tell the parents not to be over anxious. Right. The moment they are over anxious, it automatically percolates down to the students. So that's the first right. thing, to be calm. Secondly, it is the parents who have to make use of this time fruitfully. Tell them about so many things. Tell them about their life. Tell them about their childhood. Teach them those little skills that the children don't learn, whether it's making their bed or helping the parents. These are all bonding time. Why can't we not make this as a bonding time which will last the child till eternity? 
So that's the first thing. It will be a win-win situation, both for the parents and for the... So this distance between the parent and the child will go. That is the first thing. Then we come to the students. The other thing is students have to understand that everything is not education, education, and education. Yes, you allocate a couple of hours for education. That is there. It is being done by uh, online classes. It, this is staggered, as the man had already said, that you know, sitting in front of the screen for a number of hours continuously is not good and healthy. So in a staggered way, do that. It is reinforced by worksheets and assignments and things like this. That is done. Then after that, what the children should do is do a little bit of self-learning. Another thing that we are doing here is what we call the flipped learning method. Beforehand, the teachers have to tell the students that this is what we are going to do. In the process, the child reads whatever has, is going to be taught, comes to the class, there is an entire group, they discuss, and in the process, their problems, anxieties, it also sort of improves, or they try and understand each other. So that's a very, very good thing that they can do. Yes, definitely, as another uh, of my colleague was saying, that it can be used for remedi uh, remediation, it is a great opportunity, all these are there. And the thing that was being said earlier, shun the digital learning, that is now not going to be there. It is only going to be a facilitator, it's going to be always a helping tool. So that's what the student should be doing. As far as the teachers, I must, everybody right from the parents, I just sent a note to the parents saying that please understand the plight of the teachers as well. Correct. They are doing a lot of household work, willy-nilly, whether we like it or not, they are doing everything. Apart from that, they are committed enough to give time slots to the children. You cannot ask the teachers, you know, I only want to study at this time. No, because they also have children at home. They may be just having one or two computers with them. They also have to study. They may be in other schools. So keeping everybody together, we have to frame a plan. So this is a time of bonding. This is a time of understanding. This is a time of giving, sharing, learning. This is what it has to be there. And in the process, the school has become stronger because the other things I wouldn't like to tell because everybody is talking about uh, keeping a safe distance and washing your hands and maintaining all the other rules that the government is saying. Wonderful, wonderful. Now we'll have some uh, rapid questions. Mm -hmm. And not fire the answers. Mm -hmm. Karuna, if you would have world's attention for 30 seconds, what would you say? Uh, I would say that uh, God has given us this opportunity. Uh, let's take it in a positive way. Let's utilize it to the fullest. And um, uh, let's not uh, uh, see that what consequences it will bring because when we fall into negativity we start thinking of all these things but yes when we are into positive we should start understanding that what all positive things we can do what all new learnings we can uh, take from each other online like uh, one pranav you know we are all sitting together and uh, learning something new which i don't think I mean, initially i was not geared up for this but yes now I can say confidently that I am uh, part of it and I can um, do a bit without that also. Wonderful. Manju, if you can change, uh, if you get the power to change the history, what incident or what would you like to change in the history? Indian history. <laughs> Indian history. Yeah. Um, I would certainly like to bar the entry of coronavirus into India. Good one. <laughs> Very good one. Keep our country and our children and all of us safe. Okay. Rashna ma'am, hmm. if you have a choice to press a button that will make all the people on this earth to make 7% happier, but also if you put a ban on all hair styling products, what will you do? Okay. <laughs> So what do you want me as an answer? 7% so can only will be... Will you press the button? Uh, I'll press the button saying that 7% yes, definitely happier. They should be. Okay. okay. By being a little humane. Okay, okay. Thank you so much, all of you. 
Thank you, Pranav. And, and anyone, you. anyone uh, would like to add something uh, on this uh, medical emergency and these uh, lockdowns, uh, closures of schools and colleges? He is most welcome. Just yeah. one thing I would like yeah. to say, Pranav, yeah, if, sure. if I'm allowed. Uh, uh, Rashnan, can, you, can you adjust your camera properly? We can't see you. Can you see me now? Yeah, we can see. Just one thing I would like to say, Pranav, here is that can we make the children write down a few blessings to count their blessings? If they just write a few things, I, I am happy or I am fortunate that these are the things, maybe it will sink in somewhere how fortunate they are wherever they are compared to the others who are listening. And this in turn will hopefully make a better world. Wonderful. Can Wonderful. I add to this? Yeah, yeah, please. Um, what uh, we do is we post uh, one re uh, affirmation every day. Okay. So it goes to all the children. Wonderful. Once Wonderful. in the morning, every day we post one affirmation. Wonderful. 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 That's really great. Yeah, Wonderful. very nice. Awesome. Karuna, ma'am, would like to say something? I just uh, wish that uh, this situation ends as early as possible and we are back to school to see our children lovely children lovely teachers we are actually missing that <laughs> thank you so much karuna ma'am principal sam international school dwarka new delhi madam manju sharma principal delhi public school south bangalore madam rashna pant principal ramjas school rk puram new delhi thank you so much all of you for your time thank you so much ma'am Thank, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you.